and to meet uh, a good friend, D D Dara. Um, we met at a, at, a, at, a, at a color event, didn't we? At, at a Dulux, at a Dezine event in London. That and is... Uh, and we've been on online friends ever since. And, uh, t t you know, we're, um, Dara's based in London and she has a, an office in Hong Kong. We're both working in China. In fact, we're, we're, we're both working in Selfridges. We, we did the Wonder Room and I'm seeing you've just got a project uh, for Selfridges <laughs> upstairs. So uh, do say hello to uh, the, 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 the crew there. But I wanted to say thank you for joining us. I know you're a very busy mum and uh, fantastic designer. Uh, Dara runs her own practice called DH Liberty in L London and has projects all around the world for brands like Cartier and the most of the big developers and hotel hotel uh, chains around the, I shouldn't say chain, should, should I? I said the boutique hotel uh, around the world. So um, I'm gonna keep it going fast. I know you, you're, you're, you're busy. Um, are we good with the slides, Brian? Let's go, here we go. Dara, are you ready? You okay, Dara, you're good to go? <laughs> Can, can you hear me? Yes. You can hear me, right? Okay, I'm definitely not ready. Um, but just to understand, so I have 10 seconds, is that right? Or 20 seconds, or was it 10 minutes? You get 20 and seconds, 20 slides, and they auto forward, and you 20 chat. seconds. Yeah, 20 seconds, you good. Each slide. Each slide. Okay, I, I just want to preface and say that I didn't follow directions, because I literally, sh I'm showing you 20 things that I love. That's I. <laughs> they were the directions <laughs> okay but the, it's not very educational so i figured um there's enough about my work so i want to show you 20 things that are very personal to me so fantastic okay so this is my son and he's my greatest piece of work his name's wolfie he's now looks like the image on the left mm -hmm. oh i can go a little slower than that yeah <laughs> Um, I'm a co-parent, you guys. I'm a working mom. It's a real thing. It's very difficult. I juggle um, homeschooling and Wolfie and life. Um, this is a project we do. So I love architecture. I think that's obvious. I'm an architect. Um, this was a new build house we did in um, Lago Maggiore. Um, we also do a lot of interiors and um, we do furniture now. So I obviously love design. Um, okay. Again, very personal. I love fashion. Um, I try not to, you know, Instagram about it too much because I don't want to be like a, a fashion blogger by any means. But I think when you're a designer, it's kind of natural that um, you like the design of everything, whether it's like clothes or shoes or accessories. Or I love food, guys. It's it's like. I don't know. I'm Asian. You guys live in Japan. You know how it goes. Like I'm obsessed. It makes me happy. I love the textures. I love the colors. I love the simplicities. This is my good friend, Alex. I think arguably the one of the best chefs in the world. And luckily he comes over and cooks sometimes. I love furniture design. Um, so this is one of our projects. Um, it's a combination of some bespoke design furniture and some furniture we buy from other designers. Um, we're not biased. We buy from all and we get inspiration from everywhere. This is um, a, like a tech office, financial office on the right. And um, this was uh, a house on the left. And I love Hong Kong. As Mark said, I have an office in Hong Kong. And um, it's, you know, every time I go there, it's something new. It's something different. The food, the energy, the lights, the, uh, you know, horizontal travel leaders. It just feels like you're living in the future. It's um, full of exciting things. I miss it so much. I love my family. So my parents are still together. They've been married for, you know, 40 plus years now. They're immigrants from Taiwan. Um, my dad was very big on education. Um, and now it's me and Wolfie and my sister and her kids. So yeah, I'm very big on family. They've supported me on my ups and downs and it's a never ending roller coaster sometimes. I love to travel and I feel like as I was putting this presentation together, I realized that I was putting in all the things I can't do anymore. <laughs> um, so, you know, like Mark and Astrid, I've been all over the world. I'm sure you have too. I usually go for work. So every one of these photos was for work. I love a good conversation. And honestly, I didn't know what photo to put for this, but this was a photo of me and Tom Dixon making fun of each other. We're pure opposites in personality. He is a freaking Grinch 
And I am like, uh, um, I don't know, I'm like Christmas Day. <laughs> and so we had this dinner and we we're just making each other smile and frown. And it was funny. I love spas and hotels. So every time I travel for work, I always use the spa and hotels. And funny enough, we just design a lot of spas and hotels and questions I get asked is like, how do you know a good spa and hotel? I'm like, well, I've been to hundreds and I'll keep going to them. And I don't relax a lot and I don't have time to. So yeah, when I'm traveling, I, I try to relax. I love my team. I love my colleagues. I felt like with lockdown, lockdown um, I felt very isolated sometimes, but I would get on a Zoom, which is how I see them now. And it would just bring all this energy and life to me and what we do. And I'm very grateful for them. We're an all woman run team. Um, not a lot of people know that, but the management team is all women. And then the team at large, of course, is equal men and women. And in fact, I think more men. Um, I love the completion of the project. So for me, I love the beginning of the project, which is like acquiring it, the vision, that um, the whole like, you know, talking to the client. And I love the end when I walk in and it's done. And I'm like, oh. And I hate the middle. I'm just kidding. I love the middle. If my clients are watching, I love the middle. Um, I love new company ideas. So over COVID, I decided to start a furniture line. I know someone shoot me, right? But um, people are focusing on the home and I'm an entrepreneur at heart. So we're about to launch our new furniture range. And I love my home. And I think as an architect for a long time, I'm like, ooh, interior design. Like, I don't want to call my, you know, like there's like the stigma. Let's you know, admit it. Um, but the truth is, I am obsessed with interior design. We actually, most of our work is interiors. And um, after my furniture, I'd love to do a home or line, obsessed with interiors, love my home. Sleeping. So this is so important for all you designers that don't sleep. Guess what? You should sleep. It is an incredibly important thing to do. I couldn't find a photo of me sleeping because I was sleeping, but this is uh, the largest penthouse in Milan that we've designed. And this would be my idea of the room I'd like to sleep in. Um, but I don't <laughs> sleep in that room, unfortunately. I love to paint, so I don't have any time to do it. I grew up as a painter before I decided to become an architect. And now I, yeah, I'm a designer architect, but um, every now and then I still paint and I love kind of a, white, uh, a wet on wet wash. And I do it with a giant mop. You guys, I'm not kidding. I actually take a mop and I, okay, this is not a narcissistic photo, but I couldn't find a photo of me working out. And funny enough, because I Instagram story all the time, I found photos of me working out around the world in hotels or different cities, wherever they had a gym. I always made sure I popped in. You get really fat over COVID and travel. Um, not, okay, I love Netflix, all right? I'm, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I was watching um, Sex in the City part two the other night and they were traveling and I was feeling nostalgic and I sent that to a friend. So that was the only photo I could find from Netflix. Guilty as charge. I watch Bling Empire and all those really crappy, terrible shows. I love eating out. This is a restaurant by um, uh, Pera Janovic. And every time I eat out, I get inspired by the atmosphere, the, even the cutlery, the plates, the furniture, that everything. And I do absorb that into my own ideas in design. And all my inspiration comes from my life, my travel, my history, my childhood. And I love a good party. And because I put this together like an hour ago, I could not, I could not finish. I'm so sorry. Um, I, I really, I have tons of good party photos, but I also like a quiet night in. So let's, you know, I just put that cause it's COVID and we're in tier five lockdown in London right now. So um, I've, I've had plenty of nights in. That's it guys. Hey Dara, sorry. That was perfect, and it was spot <laughs> on target. And thank you for putting so much effort into that. I know what I know. Really? Pulling all your photos together, but twenty in twenty an slides in an hour, you've done it. You've done a, a remarkable job, and uh, we really love your energy and your passion and and your love for for all things which are good. Yeah, I think that's <laughs> which inspire. Yeah, no, that's you're so sweet, guys. I'm inspired by you. We're never off. <laughs> uh, you know, it's kind of uh, everything counts. Everything matters, and everything has to look the part. So totally, <laughs> um, yeah. I, I, yeah, I've always been a big fan of you guys, even since before you even knew I was born. <laughs> so thank you for having me. I'm, I'm deeply honored, thank you. No, we're, we're deeply honored to have you on uh, on, for, on for International for Chat today. We, we've got nearly 200 uh, presenters over 24 hours and we're in hour 13, I think right now. Uh, 14, uh, just the beginning of our 14. So thank I you. Don't, uh, thank uh, you.
And uh, we'll see you soon. Yeah, and we'll uh, see you uh, soon. Quick, 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 quick question. Your furniture, is it true that if we pour, pour red wine onto the white? Yes. Okay, because we were having... Um, <laughs> <laughs> it is I'm the first stain-proof designer, family-friendly, affordable furniture. And I did that through a joint venture with the founder of Perennial. She's a wonderful woman. And um, they liked our collection and they have this incredible fabric. So I was really lucky to find that. Awesome. Okay, so I I banned white furniture in our in our, our, our office design. No, you don't have to. Now back it. It's not people. <laughs> all the architects. You can all have white furniture again. <laughs> it's been my dream. So. And uh, and you know our mouth our jaws dropped when Mark said, "Oh, you can use this white furniture." <laughs> and I said, "What?" Send you, you guys one yeah. just because I love you so much. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm. I, I am. I'm not joking. I'll like text you later. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Dara, thanks All so much. Right, Dara, if, you. If, if you want to leave any any, any links to your uh, office in in the chat, please do. Um, oh, we'll be, uh, I, can we'll, chat. We'll I will love that. Yeah. Right. Thank Bye. you. Bye, Bye guys.